So, uh, <clears throat> just want to give y'all a little look at, uh, I've got my goats here and y'all can see I've got my lab also. Trying to get uh, my lab and Great Pyrenees kind of used to each other. Uh, and that dog just uh, hit the electric fence. I guess it didn't like that too much. But uh, over the past uh, few days, I've been letting the, the lab come in. And uh, kind of be around the dog a little bit. This dog don't want to quit barking. But uh, I've just been trying to get them used to each other so when this puppy right here gets bigger, they won't, maybe they won't fight too much. Uh, I'm hoping. Oh, because I'd hate for him to, this great Pyrenees to kill my lab. But uh, I think it'd be best to just let them be get used to each other while the this puppy's little, because it won't take it long to get very big. And the goats aren't afraid of her, and uh, which which is good. So and the puppy. Doesn't seem to be afraid of it. Just kind of curious. It started coming out of its pen, out of the fence line here lately. And uh, I'm hoping once it gets too big to fit through the holes, it won't try to get out. But it just comes and kind of sits around out front here and watches. But I'm just letting them kind of play through the fence right now. My lab, she's not not a real aggressive dog. She's uh, hasn't really ever seen an enemy, but I've had dogs in the past with her that they want to fight and she wants to play. So I'm letting the puppy find out that my lab just likes to play now. So when they get bigger, there won't be an intimidation there. They'll be friends by then, hopefully. Even though they won't see each other very much, but this dog will keep my house when she comes out. I don't want them to fight because she, she likes to run over here in, in the dark. But uh, that's about it. I just want to show you how I'm kind of letting them get used to each other. But... Uh, I guess I'll post more videos as things go along.